One box. Two box. We have got some unboxing to do. Hi, I'm Amy, the Rainy Day Shopper. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, thank you so much for joining me because we are gonna open some boxes today. Now, uh, this whole unboxing phenomenon, if you are new here, I have recently discovered a love of it. It's just kind of fun to open boxes and take things out. Now, if you're feeling a little sad because you do not have a box of your own, I will pause for a second. Go get yourself a box, put some stuff in it, open it up, pretend like you didn't know what was there. I can totally talk. I'm just so excited about these boxes. And then you can take things out while I'm taking things out. And it'll be fun while unboxing is together. I'll totally, I'll just wait right here. Okay, I'm a doof. It's all right. We'll be fine. But I do have two boxes, mostly because they're kind of small boxes, and so I thought that this wouldn't be a very long video if they were just, you know, this box. Actually, I don't know what this box is. It's a FabFitFun starter box. Pam, who is a viewer, sent me a little code thingy. So it was this box, this box, let me just show that box again, was $5. I have no idea what's in it. I don't know how they start you off being fab, fit, and fun all at once. Ooh. Uh, but we'll see. So I'm going to open this. And then the second box is like a reseller mystery box from one of the people that I follow on Instagram, who's also a reseller. And her box is fabulous looking. So I'll talk about that when I get to it. But first, let's start with the Fab Fit Fun box. And I've got my skizzers because that's what you need in order to open the box. I know some people do this beforehand, but I think part of the fun is just actually slicing it, though I can't hold it up and slice it because I'd be bound to cut a finger off. All right. So I've got a little... Ooh, look, they're happy people. And they're a happy, different kind of people, so they're trying to represent everyone, which is good. Um, let's see, it says... Your box is full of secrets. Ooh, and we're sharing them. Hey, it's not nice to share secrets. Really, people? Okay. How the box is curated. Eat seasonally. Yes, um, that's why I have my garden. And oh my god, the number of beans that I have picked. Ugh. It's been a really weird garden year. But that means my bean season has been long. Really long. They're starting to kind of wind down now. I'm, I'm getting some mites, I think. Mites or leaf miners? Don't really know. I'm trying to figure it out. Organic gardening. Yay. Uh, ooh, five ways to boost your workout. So there's a little thingamabobber. Ooh, look, and there's a quiz. I can quiz myself just in case I want to go back to school. All right, let's put that over there. Uh, we got a note from us. FabFitFun is excited to bring me a box. All right, cool. I, I haven't really done any of these kind of boxes before. I'm really, I'm a reseller on Poshmark and on eBay. So I'm mostly looking for stuff to resell. Now, if there's some fun things in here that I can use myself, of course I'm going to keep them and enjoy them and be fab, fit, and fun all myself. But um, I'm not planning on, whoa. Uh, it tells me on the back. They ruined the surprise. It told me on the back what's in the box. Okay, I'm going to put that down there and pretend I didn't see it. I didn't really read it. But... Um, so I'm excited to see what's in here actually based on that and maybe I do like these boxes. All right, I'm tearing the paper, sorry. Crumply, 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 ah. All right, let's see what's in this box for $5. Okay, so, ooh, uh, this is Tula Probiotic Skin Care and it is Purifying Face Cleanser. It removes dirt impurities and makeup gently and effectively. Skin is left balanced, clarified, and prepped for skincare. Wait, this isn't the skin. There's more. There's more after this. But you didn't send me the more after this. Ooh, tricky. I see you, FabFitFun. I see you with the trying to lure me into buying facial products, which I probably need anyway. I mean, I have facial products. I just have to actually use them. Mm, you know. Mmm, all right. Ooh, there are more things. So this box has four things in it because I can count and it also said so on the note that I tried not to read. Um, let's see. This is Hue, A-C-V, which I believe means apple cider vinegar because it says right below it, apple cider vinegar hair mask. This is color safe, free of paraben, sulfon, Gluten, silicone, and cruelty. Oh, good, because I really hate to put cruelty in my hair. It makes me such a bitch. I mean, I just don't need the added help. 
I do that fine on my own. Uh, let's see. Deep conditions with smart proteins that target damaged areas of the hair blend with fatty, acid-rich rosehip, avocado, coconut oils, safflower seed extract products, color, and enrich vitamin B5 to help strengthen the hair. Actually, this sounds good. So this is a mask. You leave it on for 3 to 20 minutes, rinse thoroughly, and leave often, uh, use as often as needed. Actually, this kind of interested to try out because the 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 if you know the the hair and the plopping this is me and that I just didn't want to wash my hair so I brushed it out and it's like the frizzy occasionally I like to remind myself how my hair looks out, like without products because this is what it looks like eh. um but this is cool I'm interested to try that okay let me just put that down here pardon the view of the top of my head again let's try and see if we oh look there you get an eyeball oh I knocked over the other thing okay what's this uh oh it's in bubble wrap this is exciting. Let's see what's this. Um, hmm. Where's the opening part of the bubble wrap? This, usually they have a flap. How the heck they, they sealed this in? This is magic. Okay, let me see if I can just rip it. Nope, that's tough bubble wrap. Okay, I'm gonna have to break out the scissors in an awkward attempt to open the bubble wrap. If I can find my scissors. I put them behind me, I thought, okay. Where did I put my scissors? Oh, wait. I did not put them behind me. I put them behind the box. I have found the scissors. Don't worry. We shall see what is in this bubble wrap. Oh, yes, we shall. All right, here we go. Cut, 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 cut. Now I can't reuse the bubble wrap. I like when they have the little flaps and then you can seal them again because then you can reuse them. I'll still keep this and use it for something. Okay, this is an ish. It is ish. Uh, I am as, oh. <laughs> I'm smoking hot palette. <laughs> Doesn't take me. I can, I can read the hashtag. I'm smoking hot. Arr. Let's see. This is a day to night palette with 10 shades that include perfect mattes and shimmers. Cruelty free. Again, it's so nice that we're not going to make my eyes cruelty like enhanced because frankly, I... The only time I ever got in trouble was at school was because of a look I gave my piano teacher in second grade. My parents have since named that look the piano teacher look, but I got sent to the principal's office. It's a story and I'm probably gonna tell it now because I feel like it. So I took, and I'm trying to open this. So I will talk and try to peel back without breaking a nail. Mm, working in the garden, my nails get all messed up in the summer, just saying. So first grade I took piano at school and I had a great teacher. She was amazing. I was playing simple Bach and Beethoven pieces by the end of the year and I'm still working on this, don't worry. And so I was a bridesmaid for, I mean a little flower girl for her, for her wedding and she was awesome, loved her. Well, she got married and she went off and did things married people do. Um, but, so we got a new guy the next year and I was not super fond of him because he was not my teacher. And, but my mom's like, give him a try. You want to learn how to play piano, blah, 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 blah. So he put me back to playing how much wood could a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood. And I'd been playing simple Bach and Beethoven. My mom's like, it's okay, because he wanted all of his pupils to be at the same place in the book. I didn't, Anyway, so he told me then I was supposed to practice a half an hour a day. Which, as a good young whippersnapper, I did thoroughly, even though I didn't really need to. So I went in and I played it for him, right? This is, oh, it's almost open, look. And I'm almost in my story, this is fabulous. So I went in and played it for him. And he says to me, I'm a little seven year old, right? And I'm like, okay, I'll just play this and I don't look at the book, you know, blah, blah, blah. And I thought he'd be so excited and I'm memorized because he didn't tell me to memorize, but you know, you practice that one piece a half an hour a day, you're gonna memorize it unless you're a doofus. And I'm only mostly a doofus sometimes, but not about that. So he looks at me and he goes, how dare you memorize that? That was going to be your lesson for next week. And I looked at him like. And I probably, I was a little like doe either. I looked at him like, mm-hmm. I got sent to the principal's office for a look. That's all I'm saying. I don't need more cruelty in the eyes because apparently I've got it. Ooh, look, it's ish. Now I don't know if I, if I, oh, I take this sticker off. Oh. Oh, no, that's just a magnet thing. I don't know what that is. So, ooh, that's kind of pretty. Those are good shades, actually. I was thinking I could sell that, but those are kind of good shades for me. I'll have to see if I already have these shades. I don't really, I don't have the makeup, the fancy things. Um, okay, so 
I saw in that little thing because I read really fast that card and this is something I'm really excited about actually because I've never seen one of these and everyone talks about them online especially if you're a part of the reseller community and people talk about oh I'm so excited to find this I want to find this um, but I don't know if this will be something because it's in these boxes um, but this is a show me your moo 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 um, it's a show me your moo moo it's a brie robe the Garden of Blooms, and I'm not gonna open it because if I want to resell it, I don't think that'll fit me anyway because my booty big, and I don't know this big, as big as my booty is big. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, uh, I might wanna resell this because it's in the box and I'm a, I wanna resell things, and oh, for five bucks though? Okay, Fab Fit Fun, I was not sure how I felt about you, but based on this here little box of goodness, I may love you, and this is terrible because I just canceled you because I don't want to spend 50 bucks right now, mostly because I'm buying too much to resell, so I'm poor as heck. Um, I'm making money. I just keep spending it all on more stuff to sell. Uh, we'll, we'll balance out, right? That's what happens when you start a business. So this was the FabFitFun box, and uh, for the starter box, five bucks. Highly recommend it. I don't know if I can give a little code. If I can give a little code, I will put it down in the description in case you want one of these fabulous little starter boxes. For five bucks, I think you should order yourself one. And let's try the hair masking and see if we all defrizz slightly. All right, let me put this down. And we got another box to open. This is exciting. All right, so this is uh, the Nina Epic Storm. Look at that cute. She's got a cute little cartoon of herself. And this box is all printed. It says, thank you. Oh, my gosh. She's got all over the box. She's got herself. She's got her Instagram. Hold on. I'm totally going to sneeze now. Okay. So apparently when you pick up the box and you put the box down on your little turny offy clicky thing, it makes your camera go but -ku, but -ku, but -ku, but -ku. I'm trying to figure out what's going on and this falls on the floor and I figured out. I'm like, so I'm back now. I have box, I have open box with the scissors so that I didn't have to awkwardly do that as long as I was paused anyway. Scissors on ground, let's go. All right, so this box from Nina Epic Storm and I will put a link to her Instagram if you were interested and to her Poshmark closet. Based on what you see here, you can decide if you'd like to order or not. Now, she did make it very clear this box was ten dollars, so it is. I'm not expecting like Prada in here. I'm probably not. I'm not expecting Miss Me jeans. I don't know what it is. I ordered the box in a one X because then I can maybe wear the stuff, or I can resell the stuff, or my mama could wear the stuff. And actually, I bought this box because my mama signed up on Poshmark, and I will put my little code below if you want to sign up on Poshmark. If you're new, you can sign up there too. Um, so she gets a $10 credit when she uses my little code thingy to sign up. Um, sometimes it's five, sometimes it's 10. It just depends on time and whatever Poshmark's mood is, I guess. So I was like, hey mom, one of my friends over on the Instagram says she's got box for $10. You wanna order that there box? And my mom said, uh-huh. And I said, okay, let me do that for you. So uh, this box really costs six something because of shipping. And I'm expecting two to four pieces of decent clothing not high end, not designer, or like there may be some lower end designer or some mall brands in here, but again, I have no idea. So two to four pieces, let's see what's in here. That's why again, why I'm doing this with the other box, even though the other box was fabulous. I'm kind of fun about that box. Ooh, Pam, thank you so much for sending me the link to that box, by the way. So, okay, this is all pretty. Oh good, bubble thingies, I can use those. I don't want to reuse her box though because it's not my box and I would feel awkward. I'll probably still reuse it. I'll just put a picture. I'll just say, hey, Nina says hi to go order from her. I don't know. These are useful. Saving those. Oh, okay. It comes with this real cute little note. Let's see. Hello. I'm thrilled that you found something you love in my closet. I stand proudly behind every item that I sell. I care about fashion and the environment and I'm happy that Poshmark combines the two. It's a win-win for us all. Nina Epic Storm, you are so awesome, by the way. I appreciate you as a customer and a fellow fashionista. Enjoy. And isn't that just the cutest dang thing? And it says, uh, thank you for shopping my closet. And there's something in here. Let's see what that is first. Okay, opening, opening, opening. Oh, my goodness. Hello. It's a measure. Oh, my gosh. Look, it's a measuring device. That's so fun. Okay, that you can take that with you shopping. I love these things. I used to have one and I can't find it. Ooh. Okay, and look, it has a little face on it. Isn't she cute? Okay. This is a. F I'm liking these boxes. That's all I'm saying. Oh, and it also has. 
passion, just in case. I don't have enough of that already. Dude, I'm so single, doesn't matter. I don't need passion. Well, I mean, uh, I have plenty of passion. I just got nothing to do with it except sell stuff. All right, passion. So some tea. I love Tazo tea. Very good. And then a little card to give people information about getting started on Poshmark, how to list it. This, so cute. I'm sure this is, like, this is a Poshmark card, I think. But that's a really good merchandising thing to kind of throw in here for people who are making new, oh, there's something else in here. Hold on. It may be chocolate. Oh, no, it's a mint, just in case that, um, I have bad breath. I'm just, I'll save that for later, because I can never have too much minty freshness in life. All right. So, it does look like there are at least four items in here. So it said two to four. And they are wrapped nicely in bags that I can reuse because they don't have marking on them. So I will reuse these. Uh, this is a Chaps. And let me just take it out of the box because you'll see it better. I mean, out of the bag because you'll see it better without the glare. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh, this looks like a top. Okay. This is fun. Uh... This is just a chaps, kind of a, not really paisley, but a floral with a kind of sort of hint of paisley. Eh, they look kind of more, more like Florida leaves than paisley, but uh, purple and magenta and tan. It's totally wearable. I could wear that. I could also resell that. We'll see what we do. I may do some of both. All right, I'm putting that down there on my FabFitFun box because it is FabFit and fun. It's on the floor right now. All right, what else we got? We have got something pink. Not my color pink, though. Too light washes me off. All right, this is in another fancy bag. These kind are also reusable. Uh, at least mine are. Someone I sent a package to was super excited. She thanked me for the reusable bag. It was so cute. Plus, she was adorable. And she ordered one of my favorite vintage dresses. Oh, such a great find. So let's see what do we got here. Ooh, again with the sheer. Someone's trying to get me to be all sassy. So this is just an uh, INC, which I think is a Macy's brand, if I remember. Just a 1X as requested. Uh, really cute little top. Nice. Pink. Smells like perfume. May need a wash. All right. What else we got here? Oh, oh, hey, hey, there's a surprise package on the side. There are five things in here. Hold on. I'm gonna get to the little box next. So this is just blue and black. Let's see what this is. For 10 bucks, I think so far I'm doing pretty well. I mean, yeah, I'm liking this. The little, <laughs> frankly, the little, uh, you know, measuring to tape that retracts. That was worth the 10 bucks for me. I'm, I'm easy. Well, don't tell anyone though. I don't want to get a reputation. Hmm. All right. Oh, hey, this is a dress. Oh, this might be staying in my closet. This is cute. Uh, this is just a cute little dress. Perfect. Like this is more cash. I could wear this to work. Hmm. Short sleeves. Does not seem to have a tag in the back. In fact, no tag is there. Let's see if it has a tag down here somewhere. Hello, little tag. It does have, ooh, says polyester, spandex, made in Vietnam. It has an RN number, but not a brand. So just a cute little no tag dress thing sheath. That's cute. All right, little box or big thing? Ooh, there's more. So thoughtful of her to include things I can reuse. I love these. I need some, actually. I had to send a pair of boots out in a box uh, that I had to use an Amazon box because I didn't have a box that was big enough. It wouldn't fit in my biggest priority mailbox, which I need to order some of the bigger ones, I guess. But I needed some of these and I did not have them. I had to put in a lot of tissue. But I don't want the boots to get all scratched. They were cute boots. All right, this is a big thing. It looks to be blue and it has a crumply thing on it that says extra large on the outside. All right, what are we, pretty thing? Oh, you look like a skirt, dress, skirt, dress. What are you? It is okay. Oh, a big, long, blue skirt that actually is my mama's favorite color. Um, and she's gonna love wearing this. This is... Hmm. 
<laughs> made in China because it says it's a 5XL and it'll fit like an extra large, maybe like a large. Uh, it just says fashion classic collection. So probably one of those places. But if this is not too long for mama, she's going to love this skirt because it is definitely her color blue. Not my color blue. All right, I'll put that in the mama pile. But there's something else. I got five things in my box. Five. All right. Again? Oh, no, this one has a flap. I'm like, I can't. These things I have to cut open. Awkward. Mm. All right, what do we got here? It is a box within a box. <laughs> the unboxing fun continues. Let's go. I can get it open. Oh. There's a box within the box. Within the box. I'm just saying. That's just that's just carrying things a bit too far. If there's another box in here though, I'm gonna be super excited. Alright, which way is it open? Oh wait, hold on. Will you marry me? That's a cute little ring. It looks like it's copper. I don't know. Or fake gold or something. But look at it, it's just a cute little thing. Tiny fits on my pinky. Oh, look. I'm engaged to myself, except I don't know what finger to put it on. Hmm. I don't know if that's focusing. That does not look like it's focusing. Hello? Uh, no. Anyway, will you be mine? If not, that's okay, because, you know, I'm kind of enjoying the whole single thing. <laughs> Though there's a lot of work to do around the farm with the reselling, too. All right. Well, this is cute. Two tops, a dress, and a skirt. That's a great combination. Uh, definitely. So would I say this box is worth 10 bucks? Yeah, absolutely. Now, again, if you're looking for stuff that's going to resell for like $50, probably not going to be in this box, but I did not expect that, and that was not what was advertised with this box. But I think I could definitely make $10 back, in this case $6 for the shipping. Um, but I could make that money back easily, and I'm probably going to keep two things and try and sell two things in this. I don't know what to do with a cute little ring. I don't know what it is. I'll have to figure out if it says anything on it, but I'm sure it's just a, like a rhinestone thingy. Cute little box though. Okay, yeah, I cannot see anything. Someone said, oh, someone had a good tip, is take a picture of, ooh, it does say something right there, which I can't see because it's light. Mm, no, not gonna be able to see it. Oh, I totally think I'm gonna need bifocals, which is so awkward and so, oh, bad enough to be premenopausal. And now I need bifocals. What the heck is this? Anyway, it says something there that I can't read right now because there's light in my eyes and the I'm old, whatever. I'm not old, but I'm getting there. <laughs> awkward. All right, well, if you have stuck with me for two boxes, well, actually, technically three, three boxes unboxed. Thank you so much for sticking with me. I will be probably listing some of this stuff on my Poshmark. If you are interested in anything, you can drop me an email. I will put my email down below if I remember. I'll work on that. Uh, I'll also put a link to my Poshmark closet if you are interested in shopping there for lots of kind of clothing goodness. I work really hard to find cool things and interesting things and unique things to put into my closet so that people who want to buy cool and interesting and unique things can find them in my closet. So if you see something I like, make me an offer, you know? We can negotiate. I like negotiating. It's fun. Oh, I have a story about that too, but I'm not going to tell it now because this video is going to be too long and people are going to get grumpy with me. All right. Thank you so much for watching. I hope everything is amazing with you. If you are a reseller out there reselling things, saving them from landfills, finding good treasures to pass on to people who are going to love them. Thank you so much for helping make the world a better way. Uh, I can't talk. Thank you so much for helping make the world a better place in your own way. And if you are someone who is out there who is taking a break from purchasing from large corporations and big businesses and are looking to support small local businesses and to help keep the things out of landfills and help the environment in the process, hey, Nice job. Thank you for being an awesome buyer and resellers. Keep kicking butt. I will see you all in my next video. Oh yeah, if you like this, like give the like thumbs up -y thing because people, the YouTube approves of that. They like it. Uh, subscribe, like, do whatever the things you're supposed to do to make the U YouTube algorithm happy because it's all about the algorithms. It's not all about that base. I don't know. 
no trouble. It's all about the algorithms. Just saying. I will see you next time. Oh yeah, I put videos up every Wednesday and kind of every Saturday right now, even though Saturday is iffy because I don't promise that one, but I do promise every Wednesday. So stick around, come back later. There will be, ooh, I think probably a hard goods kind of haul. And it's a mystery to me because I forgot I had this box of hard goods. So let's see what's in that in my next video. I will see you later. Bye. Thank you.